Hi y'all, it's Joanne at Junk Journal Treasures. Welcome. Today I thought I would come on and use up some more scraps. My last video I was using scraps and made some, uh, some of these clusters. So I thought I would just come back on. I've got, um, I've got my tray with uh, a lot of different scraps in here. I thought I'd use those, and I've got um, just this little pen of uh, whatnot cutouts and things I thought I'd use. And I'm going to make some uh, collage sheets. Haven't made any of those in a while, and I think they're always such fun to make. So, grab this. I'm just trying to read it. This life belongs to, that's cute. So yeah, let's start with that. Just gonna cut a piece of this. Actually, I'm gonna put this down so I don't glue all over everything and that. All right, and once again, I am using my Scotch Create. It's permanent glue stick. This is my favorite brand. I'm sure I've said it before, but I went through so many different brands of glue sticks before I found one that I actually like. And I do like this one. So we'll just start with that. And since I have this out, I'm gonna go ahead and maybe put that in the opposite corner just to get it off of my desk. So what's everybody been up to? Okay. Just gonna use some of these same pieces from yesterday. I don't know if that was yesterday, but whenever I film that, get this down. out of my way. Just putting random pieces down. I'm going to start with a lot of neutral things. I think that makes a, a nice background. And that's pretty much what we're looking to do, right? Just get a background going. Knocking things around. Okay, come on up. Glue my pieces down now. Where are we going to put this guy? Right there. What's everybody doing in these crazy times? I just listened to a news update on President Trump's condition. And thank God he's doing he's doing well. Such a scary thing. All right, let's try some more of this. Who out there likes doing collage sheets? It's one of my favorite things. Collage sheets, clusters. They're at the top of my list, too. Actually, why don't you write in the comments for me? What are some of your favorite things to make? It's always interesting to see what everybody enjoys doing.
at these pages. Isn't that patina pretty? Love that. Use a little bit of that. Two pages. Just tear some of this. brittle and I've got glue on my finger so it's kind of sticking to me. These are such fun to make. Doesn't require a whole lot of thinking, does it? You can just grab things and put them where we want. I'll try some of this. That's nice. It's a it's part of a ledger page. remember where it's from. It might be from a old ledger book and I, I think it was 1932 or something that I had gotten from my friend Johnny over at the junk journal shop. She always has a lot of cool vintage things and her journals. Oh my gosh, if you haven't seen Johnny's journals, you really need to Treat yourself, go over to her shop and have a look. It's the junk journal shop. On Etsy. Guess I should have had that, right? from uh, antique papery. Sherry has a lot of pretty digitals. I'm sure a lot of you are familiar with her and have a lot of hers. glued up. So y'all have any fun weekend plans? After I finish this, I'm going to be going over to visit my little grandnephew, my nephew's son, had some minor surgery yesterday, little trooper's not put two, but um, he's doing really well, so I'm going to go see him for a little while. Okay, moving along, what else do we have? 
Let's see. Oh, this is a page from one of Tina. Shabby Dabby Judah. What a shame. Wait, can you believe it's October already? I can't. Uh, away this year, it seems like it went so slow, but yet, I don't know, here we are towards the end of the year. Not quite sure how that happened. What else do I have? Maybe a little more of this. Yeah. remember where this is from. I think it was some sort of a bag that I had torn up. Okay, what else do we need? Um, I think I'll put some more of this ledger here. and then see what we're going to do. Okay. There. I think that's all of that. Let me... Get my scissors, let's get this trimmed up. Put all these stray pieces off. stretch now. Here we go. Okay. Oops. Left piece. Well, what the heck is that? Let's try it from over here. Okay, that's the 
bad ground. That's pretty good. I think I'm going to find a couple of focal pieces. Oh, here's another little butterfly. Yeah, I just want to find a couple other little things to focus on before we call it good. Y'all like coffee? I love my coffee in the morning. So are you coffee drinkers or tea drinkers? Or neither? somewhere. Where do we want it? Right down there. And the fun part with this is when you uh, go to cut it up, right? Don't know what you're going to end up with where. Should I put a little piece of that in there? I don't know if I want that or not. already ripped there. Why not finish it? Let's see. Let me just tear around it and use it. These collages are fun to make. And then once you make them, cutting them apart and seeing what you come up with and what you can do with them is a lot of fun. Okay. Just kind of eyeballing what we have going here. I think I'm just going to leave it for now. Then maybe I'll come back and do a video and cut it apart. Maybe make another one and Make some cards or tags or something. See what we can do. So that's it for today. I'm glad you joined me. Hopefully you liked the video. Talk soon. Happy crafting.